this bit here which comes over goes up your arm and over your neck and that goes over your shoulder and then the bottom section connects to your little strap which is on your metal detector so put it up your arm so it goes over the back of your neck when you first put it on that feels a little bit uncomfortable because it's more rigid as soon as you've worn it for the day that folds in and it's, you don't even realize you've got it on and it really does make a difference with the weight of the metal detector so that's that that's done over your shoulder over in the back of your neck and there you've got adjustments there's a strap there slide that up to suit the adjustment once you've got it set to your metal detector as it comes over your shoulder there's no elastication there that's rigid the elastic bit is the bottom section which will click into there like that but before you click it there you want it to be roughly the height of your hand wherever you set this put it back through itself pull it tight so that's now fitted to the Equinox it's already on over your shoulder simply click it onto there so when I stand up no hands it's ready for me if you see now with my hand I'm not lifting the weight I'm just balancing the weight by putting pushing down on the metal detector and it just hovers across the ground so there's no weight there at all and then if I get a signal I let go of the metal detector it automatically goes into position so I've just crouched down now I get the find out of the hole I don't think about the metal detector at this point I get the find out, I've got the find, put it in my pouch I stand up and then I just grab the metal detector and off I go again why would you want a harness on a machine the Equinox isn't that heavy uh, I even use the harness sometimes on the Deus and that's one of the lightest machines out there um, I do suffer with a bad back nine times out of ten I'm absolutely fine if my back's playing up and leaning down and especially if there's not many signals in the ground you'll be walking along your arm starts to ache if you've got arthritis in your elbow stuff like that that's when the the easy swing really comes into play i know some guys that use the mark ii easy swing and they've got a tennis elbow and it <laughs> they are in absolute agony especially if they've been walking around the field and there's not many signals going on and they're constantly swinging with no brakes which happens quite a lot put the easy swing on there's no weight on your arm. You can't feel the swing. It doesn't hurt at all. So, for the money, the Mark II Easy Swing is a really good bit of kit. It really is that simple. <laughs>